How's everybody doing today? And as you can see, we are back with the Kansas City Royals franchise. It's been about four weeks, almost a month since the last upload. So if you guys want to see more of this series, let me know in the comment section down below. Also hit that like button if you're new to the channel um, and your subscription button is red. Your subscribe button's red. What are you doing? Click it. Make sure you subscribe to the channel if you do enjoy the content. So with that being said, um, what I do want to talk about today is in the top right hand corner, there's going to be that little eye icon. Um, click it and that's today's poll do you want us to continue with the series like do you want me to continue uploading this franchise because it has been quite a bit since we qu quite a while since the last upload and i feel like maybe you guys would rather see like the zero overall franchise and we could start that so today's poll question yes continue the franchise or no start the zero overall franchise and then we'll do whatever that is um, whatever you guys decide to vote on um it's my fault not uploading this as consistently as i should have um but it's it is what it is so let's let's get into today's video let's focus on what we're gonna do um today we are gonna play another game i'm thinking about maybe maybe taking on maybe the twins or the tigers maybe the twins maybe the braves i think the braves could be a good one but we are gonna make a couple roster moves we're going to be acquiring a bullpen arm. Jorge Lopez, just not doing too great this season. Um, and neither is the uh, the backup shortstop in JT Riddle. I was kind of hoping he would have done a little bit better. Um, unfortunately, he is not. So we're going to add him to the trade block. And what we're going to be doing is we're going to be adding Carl Edwards Jr. You can see um, he's an 81 overall. But his stats this season have been pretty solid. So I feel like adding him to the bullpen would definitely help us out so with that being done we now kind of look like this all right so we're kind of kind of loaded in the bullpen what i want to do is i'm going to send kevin mccarthy down he's really struggling this year and i feel like you know maybe he needs some time in the minors and now we have an empty spot here in the starting rotation and what i'm going to do is i'm going to sign dallas keichel to a pretty big one-year deal um see if he takes it he should um he should there we go so a pretty big one-year deal i feel like if it goes well we can always pay him like, like for a future season but for now let's just sign him up for one year see how that goes and if it goes well then we're set but now we're kind of you know the the starting rotation the bullpen got stronger um as you guys can see we now Kind of have like a, a decent little one two three going here i want to put keichel maybe the two spot junis in the three spot um, we got keller there maybe even maybe even like this um, we'll, we'll leave it like this for now but i think right now the the bullpen looks a lot stronger um you know we've added edwards bryce has been good deekman has been good our closer has been lights out for us um now we just added keichel and one more roster move really quickly is um I want to bring up, where is he? Nicky Lopez. So in real life, Nicky Lopez was brought up and he's actually doing quite well. Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm not going to adjust his stats or anything too much. I'm just going to boost everything up by two um, just because um, in real life, he's actually been doing quite well. Um, and I feel like he has a little bit better potential and overall than what he is rated in this installment of the roster that I'm using. So what we're going to do is it's boosted up to a 68 overall. Um, and I feel like for now, that's a good a good rating for where he's at. Nothing too crazy or anything like that. So what we're going to do now is we're just going to hop into a game. Um, Alrighty, so lineups for today. Nicky Lopez is going to be stepping in at second. We're going to move Wit to third. And then... Um, Hunter Dozier was kind of tired, so he's going to be sitting out. We also are going to be seeing Dallas Keuchel take the mound for the third time in a Royals uniform. He is 2-0 on the season with us. He looks like he's a great addition to the lineup so far. I'm really liking what I'm like what I'm seeing with those stats. And uh, we, may, we may have a new ace on our hands if he continues to pitch well. But you guys can see um, the Braves. I saw they had a new player added Odubel Herrera into the lineup um, but you know they got Acuna they got Albies they got a good solid team so I thought it'd be a good little 
a good little game for us. We're going to be rocking our light blue away throwbacks. They're also rocking a throwback of their own. Kyle Wright is looking solid this season. 10-3 and on the year, a 263 ERA. Okay, not a bad matchup for us. So, Keiko Wright, let's hop into it. Let's see how things go. Alrighty, 1-1 one, one count here. Fastball. All right, a little late, a little behind on it, but we're sitting 1-2 here. Come on. Let's go, Wit. Let's keep this inning alive. And the fastball gets me again. I was sitting off speed. And that's going to be the inning. A pretty quick inning. Ooh. And it looks like this might be a double. Alex Gordon come up throwing. Does he got it? Ah, if he wouldn't have taken that like lunge into the wall, he may have had him at second. But unfortunately, a leadoff double for Albies. Keiko misses his spot. Hits it down the third base line. And Ozzy, ha Ozzy hustles into second with the double. Marcakis is up now. All right, there we go. There's an easy out. Mondesi gets it after Marcakis. First pitch swings the plate. Change up now. And Freddie's worked it full. All right. Josh Donaldson's up next. So we got to be careful here. All right. 3-2 count still. And uh, we missed our spot. And Freddie Freeman, great at bat, was like 10 pitches. Uh, and he, you know, he gets a walk. So now we got Josh Donaldson up. Change up down. Okay, we get the strike. Full count again. Really making Keiko work. The slider. Whit Merrifield makes the play. Oh, wasn't able to double him up. Ooh, we still get the out. The line drive. Whit Merrifield made the play at third. It's a pretty long inning for the lefty. Change up right down the middle. And luckily for us, Mondesi is going to toss it over to Lopez. And a tough first inning for Keiko, but we get out of it. Alrighty, so after a pitch pretty much down the middle, we're sitting 3-1. And like I said, high fastball sitting on it. Is that going to get down? It is extra bases for our first baseman. And a leadoff double starts us off right I told you he's been liking that high fastball. I was sitting for it, and look what happens. 19th double for Josh Bell. High fastball, there it was. Perfect. Alrighty, Solaris killing it on the road. Not so much at home. So let's see if he can continue that trend in today's game. Get us the first run of it. You know, get us the first run of the game. I, is that carrying? It's carrying. Is it going to stay in? It's off the wall. It's going to be a double. Solaire just misses a home run. It's off the wall. His 15th double of the oh, the season just missed that home run. Oh, man. I thought it. I thought maybe it had the chance. Comes out of the glove of Marcakis, it looks like. But all right. All right. 0 1 count. Two straight off speed. Man, he's been favoring the fastball. Now he's switching it up on us. What's going to happen here? Can we keep the inning alive? Takes the fastball down in, down in the zone. One-two count to our catcher. Can Salvi deliver? Two outs. All right, he takes ball two. All right, he two-two count. So after two doubles, and we're going to get the runs in. Come on. Round it. 69 speed. Marquecas throws it home. Oh, it's cut off, and we have two runs. We do not squander those two, like, the two doubles to lead off the inning. Josh Bell, Jorge Soler, and Salvador Perez delivers with the two RBI single. Oh, man. I thought we wasted that opportunity for sure. All 
Dallas Keuchel goes down swinging, but oh well, it doesn't matter. We still get those two runs in thanks to Salvador Perez's clutch hitting. Whew, a two-out single puts us up two to nothing. Can we get, you know, get the strikeout to start the inning? Oh, wow. He was sitting fastball. Is that going to stay fair? I think it it just went foul. Oh, man. Thank goodness for that. And the changeup. All right. Well, that got, that got a little dicey for a second. Cutter inside. Part of the plate. Can we make the play? Alex Gordon. What? Did the sun get in his face or something? What happened there? He's just going to drop a ball like that? It had to have been the sun. I mean, look at that sun just beaming in. I don't understand that. That's a line drive to a gold glover. That should be a routine play. I'm gonna. I'm blaming the sun for sure. All right, well, Brian McCann's up now. Let's see what we can do here. We got him looking silly on the slider. Okay. Let's go with the changeup, see if we get the double play ball. That's a tie game. Oh boy, we hung that one for sure. Change up down the middle. Brian McCann's going to do that to you. His ninth home run of the season. And uh, it's it's tied up pretty quickly. Oh yeah, that's, that's right down the middle. We missed our spot badly. Alrighty, back to the top of the lineup. Ozzy Albee steps in. Doubled last time. Uh, and he's going to stay. He's going to stay hot today. A single. And it's looking like the changeup's missing the spot a lot. Because that, that missed the spot as well. And um, it's not good. Yeah, you guys can see that. That caught way too much of the zone. So there he goes. Salvi get him. He's safe. He gets in under the tag, unfortunately. So, man in scoring position. Nick Marcake is up. 1-1 one, one count. All right. Got to be careful here. It's a good cutter. Fouls it off. So, 1-2 count. Let's go up and in. Oh, no. All right. Easy play for Nicky Lopez. Inning over. But damage was done. Ah, <sighs> two-run bomb by McCann. If Alex Gordon makes that play, it's only it's only one run. 1-0 to our second baseman. There we go, a base knock up the middle, sat back on the curveball this time. And he's able to take it right back up the middle. Perfect to keep the inning alive there. There we go, second baseman. Just doing what he needs to do, just keeps the inning alive. Nice little single. Got Alex Gordon up. Let's see if he can make up for that error earlier in the game. Is that going to get down? I don't think it is. Diving catch by Nick Marcakis. Are you serious? If that gets by, that's a run 100%. Ah, what a catch. What a catch. Can't be mad about it. Can't be mad about it. Alrighty, 1-1 one, one count. Change up. Get some swinging. Okay. We're going to go cut her low and away. Hopefully hit our spot. Okay, comes inside. And luckily for us, he fouls it off. Alright. Fastball low and away. Fastball right down the middle. It's going to be fouled again. All right, let's see if we get him with the low slider. It goes inside, and it's supposed to be outside. So 2-2 two, two count now to the catcher. Let's just get the out here. Come on. Oh, man. 70 pitches through four. Keichel's really working today. All right, here we go. 2-2 two, two count. Going back to the changeup. That kind of got us in trouble last time. Can Bell get it before it goes foul? He can't. And McCann does it again. Missed our spot with another off-speed pitch. The slider this time. <sighs> I mean, McCann, that was like a 10-pitch at bat. Like, he was fouling off everything. And what happens? We left a pitch down the middle, and he crushes it. So, again, 
He's, a, he's the killer today. And then we throw a pitch down the middle. Luckily for us, to ground out. Nicky Lopez makes the play. Can't be doing that, though. We cannot be throwing pitches down the middle. This game's going to break wide open if we keep doing that. Ooh, we get a generous call with the, the change up there. We're going high and tight with the, cur uh, the cutter. Okay, it wasn't high and tight, but we still get the strikeout. Damage was done, though. We're, we've given up our lead. Three unanswered by the Braves, all of which have come from Brian McCann home runs. Ah, man, we got to we gotta get the bats going again. All right, he went Merrifield. You're 0 for 2 today. That's, that's not like you. As I say that, there we go. Gets the base knock. I just gotta keep. I just gotta say, hey man, what, what's going on? Why aren't you doing what you normally do? And uh, I guess he goes and gets a hit. So gets the base knock. Can't complain about that at all. We got a leadoff runner. And last time we had a leadoff runner, we scored two runs. And the guy who started that is up to the dish right now, Bell. And as I say that, what does he go and do? Another double. It's going to be close. Can he get in? He does. Another double. Josh Bell is killing it today. Two for three. Man, that is, this guy has been a great pickup for us. He is killing it. Nice little, nice little slap. Opposite field. Moves Merrifield to third. Second and third. No outs. So layers up. Can he keep it going? Full count. Oh, man. Nicky Lopez up next. The changeup got me. Oh, man. That's the first out. Okay. Oh, they're going to the lefty Johnny Venters. Really? Come on, Nicky. I just need a base hit. That's all I need. Just put it in play. Come on, 79 speed. It's going to get the run home. I'll take it. Tie ball game. Nicky Lopez delivers a softly hit grounder to third. I don't care if it's an out. I don't care if it wasn't pretty. It gets the run in. That's all that matters. All righty, Alex Gordon. 1-1 one, one count. Gets under it. And that's going to be the inning. But we do score the tying run. Nicky Lopez comes in clutch. Like I said, it wasn't pretty. It wasn't the best of hits, but it, it got the job done. Whew, we're back in it. Alrighty, Brian Flynn is coming in. Record isn't that great, but you know what? Decent ERA. The averages are about 250 for both righties and lefties. They have three lefties coming up. So let's see if we can uh, just not allow any runs. We got to keep them quiet here. Alrighty, 1-2 to Old Duble. Get him swinging. There we go. That's a great way to start it off, Flynn. So full count. We're going high fastball away this time. Fouls it off. Alright. 3-2 count. Ah, we missed the spot, but he goes after it. Gets the K. And two outs. So this guy's on fire. McCann's got our number. So we got to get him out here. Okay, that's a good start. Gets the fastball. All right. One, two count. Can we get out of this? High fastball misses the spot. I mean, a walk wouldn't be terrible here. But are you serious? Are you kidding me? This, this guy's all over us. He's in our head. He's killing us. As I'm saying, a walk wouldn't be terrible. We go and miss our spot again. He's three for three with three home runs. I'm not pitching to this guy anymore. He's killing it. He's killing it. I don't understand it. He didn't even get like the best of like contact with that. Darren O'Day. Okay. All right. Let's see how this goes. All righty, Duda. If I ever needed a pinch hit bomb more than now. I don't know. You know, I need I need it. I need a at least a hit. Oh, really? It's not gonna go fair. Just late on it. Oh man. That was that was our one pitch to hit too. Alrighty, pitch number seven. 
of the at bat to Lucas Duda. We put in some work. Another two two offering. Fouls off another one. Okay. Hanging with it that time. Keep battling, young man. Three foul balls in a row. He is calibrating that heater and the off speed. Let's see if he can catch something on the barrel. High in the air down the right field line. And foul. Making him work out there. The ninth pitch of the at bat coming up. Lucas Duda, did you just do what I think you did? Did you do it? Pinch, hit, home run, Lucas Duda. I said if I ever needed one more than now, I'd be lying because I need one really bad right now. Lucas Duda comes in, gets a hanging, I think it was a slider, and he just hits it dead center, and he comes up in the clutch. That is what we needed. Lucas Duda, you are the man. Oh, what a... What a moment that was! Whew. This game's like in a, a roller coaster of emotions for me right now. Every time I'm like, "Oh, we're back in it," then we give up the lead. Then what happens again? We get back in it. I. This is ridiculous. All right, we're we gonna bring in Drew Storin for Ozzy Albies. That's basically what it is. We're just we're bringing in Drew Storin just for Albies. Um. Because they have two lefties up next. So we'll probably bring in Deekman after that. We're playing matchups for the rest of the game. We can't can't mess around. Alright, let's go slider down and in. See if we get him. Come on, Gordon. Make the play. Please. This time he makes the catch. One out. Drew Storen gets the out. Perfect. That's what we needed him to do. We're going to bring in Jake Deekman now. And uh, see if we can uh, get these next two outs. For some reason, got no confidence. Throwing sliders way up in the zone, but luckily for us, Alex Gordon's going to camp out under this one. Don't know what that animation was. I did not like that, but we get out of the inning. One, two, three. We got the heart of our lineup up. This is this is, this is is who I want up in this situation. That was the pitch. I think I dropped the PCI a little bit too much as well. A little late on it. Oh, man. That, that was the one. That, that just got to be, that's got to be taken advantage of. There we go. This is looking like a three for three day. It is going to be just a single or a three for four day. Josh Bell swinging a hot bat. The changeup hung a little bit too much. We were a little early on it, but that's all right. I'll take the single. I'll take the base runner. Just fouls off the slider. Okay. Staying alive. Kind of sitting fastball. So I'm kind of hoping we get one up in the zone. Goes after a pitch in the dirt. That's going to be the inning. Oh, man. <sighs> okay. Swings at some garbage. I'll take it. Let's go up and in. No way. Are you serious? Opposite field, too. <sighs> Didn't hit my spot. Didn't hit the spot. It's just the tail. Of this, that's the tail of today's game. Just missing spots. What happens? They take advantage of it. And every single one of the runs is from a home run. That hurts. And that's a base hit. G Deekman's done. Oh, man, we're going to go to Tim Hill because they have another lefty up. They actually have two more lefties up because it's Joyce and McCann. So we're in a tricky spot. Oh, come on. Throw him out at second. Solaire, come on. You got the arm. No. I thought maybe Nicky Lopez would make the, make the grab. We're in trouble now. They're going to be stealing. Oh, that almost helped us out. That changeup missed. And oh boy, was that almost bad. Seriously, this guy's got our number. Come on, Hamilton. Come up throwing. He's not going to get the out. Brian McCann is destroying us. Absolutely killing us. All right, we're going to bring in the righty. 
Edwards just we got to get some outs we're in a lot of trouble right now we have no outs first and second so we're just we're just gonna have to go with it see if we can get a double play here maybe maybe come on turn it turn it ah maybe he should have stepped on third i don't know i don't know we got albies up now he's been us thorn in our side oh, he's gonna get the run home wit i mean wit kept it in front of him that's great and all but ah oh, man it's just it's all crumbling it's all crumbling now three runs we're gonna have to score in the top of the ninth <sighs> edwards gets us out of the inning i think yeah that is the third out Three runs do come across, though. Man, that that is rough. This could, I mean, we finally get some offense going in a game. It's just not in our favor, which kind of sucks. So we're down three. AJ Minter's coming in. Lefty, do we have a righty? We do, but he doesn't really hit lefties well. Um, It's better than nothing, right? Here we go. Let's do it down three top nine can we get the comeback that's not the best of starts a fly out to right i mean it was a high fastball usually a good pitch to hit a little late on it all righty one one count to our catcher come on got under it what was that a cutter no way did he not get under that? Is that gone? It's up against the wall. Really? Ju I had to have just missed that. And the catcher's up. And we got like no good hitters left. Cam Gallagher is going to step up. He's our last chance. We just missed that change up up in the zone. Oh, that sucks. All righty, Cam. You're our last chance. Come on. We can do it. I believe in it. I mean, it's going to get down. We're still alive. I can't do all right. Cam does keep us alive. Top of the lineup has been pretty poor today. I think we're one for six. One for six. I think it's one for six. Because Billy, oh no, it's one for eight. Billy Hamilton and Mondesi haven't been that great. So let's see what we can do here. And that is the game. Hamilton grounds out. Man, McCann destroyed us. He was 4 for 4 with like, what, 5 RBIs, I believe it was? 4 RBIs? That's just gross. We got, we got waxed. We got destroyed. Yeah, 3 home runs, 5 RBIs. Man. That was that was a tough one. That was a tough one. To, that was a tough one to lose. But I mean, Josh Bell three for four with two doubles. Duda came in with the pinch hit bomb, and we just we, yeah, it just sucks. We uh we lost that one. That that last inning really killed us, and Brian McCann really killed us. That was rough. That was bad. He smacked us around like crazy today. So let's let's finish out the month. Let's see how things go. Um. That's not a good Cleveland series at all. We will stop at deadline day. We are 57 and 52. We have lost our lead. We're a half game behind the Indians. Yeah, this 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 last like week and a half right here really hurt us. We needed a good series here, and unfortunately that that hurt us as well. So trade deadline day. We are we're we're in a little bit of a pickle now. We're we're starting to fall behind the Indians, which isn't good. So let's take a quick look at our lineup. Hamilton and Mondesi. Mondesi's hitting 270, which isn't terrible, um, but wish it was a little bit better. Billy Hamilton, not that great. Whit Merrifield's doing pretty solid in this three spot, um, like really good in this three spot. We got Duda. Josh Bell's looking like an amazing pickup for us. Really solid. Um, Salvador Perez, Dozier, Gordon, and Soler. It might be time to bring in Phillips for, for Gordon. I mean, I mean, his hitting stats aren't that much better if they are i mean barely but um you know 
maybe maybe it's time for Gordon to make way for Brett Phillips. So maybe we need to bring in some better hitters at the deadline. We'll have to wait and see. Pitching wise, Keiko, I mean, is doing solid. He got roughed up a little bit against the Braves, but overall, I mean, the team isn't terrible. Is it a World Series winning team? No. Where did Austin Bryce go? Did we send him down? No, he's not supposed to be down. He's supposed to be up, and McCarthy was supposed to go down. Because Bryce has been amazing for us. A 2 ERA. So, yeah, that's the team. I mean, it's not terrible. I think it could be a little bit better for sure. But um, for now, it's not a bad start to this Royals franchise. So, if you guys, again, make sure you guys vote in the top right-hand corner that poll do we continue this series or do we move on to the zero overall franchise but that's gonna wrap it up guys i hope you enjoyed today's episode we got some offense you guys have been asking for some offense in these episodes unfortunately it just it just wasn't in our favor so i'll catch you all in the next video hit the like button if you enjoyed today's episode subscribe if you're new and enjoy the content and i'll catch you all next time peace